This time I mentioned what dex cards are the best ones to use for magic. Let's do this. Okay, starting off some of these kind of fancier decks, which are like stuff like the Bicycle Ghost and the Bicycle Scorpion, for example. My main complaint about them is they look a little bit too suspicious because they're a little bit too detailed. I'm not saying that people can't benefit from them. If your presentation style fits them, then go for it. They work really well depending on your presentation style. But for the most part, for most people, I feel like these are just look a, bit, a little bit too suspicious and people are going to accuse you of using like trick cards, trickery, trick decks, you know, get you the idea. Alright, so now we got the next category, which is like the medium detailed one. So I feel that this would be a really good category for a lot of people to do because they are like not too detailed like this. Like as you can see, they're not overly detailed. They're like sort of in the middle. Like this back design isn't too much. The front design isn't too much. There's just a little bit of a different change of shade. So people won't find these too suspicious. I mean, the dragon backs are getting to the point where they're too suspicious, but they're not quite there yet. They look really cool. I like the shades, all that stuff. So anyways, these ones are sort of in the middle. I feel like these a lot of people could benefit off of. And uh, yeah, these are basically just some really nice ones. But the problem is they're not quite up there. People aren't going to recognize them. So I'll tell you which one if you want to make sure that nobody finds anything suspicious. The next one is the one you're going to want to use. All right, and if you want to make sure your cards are not suspicious at all, the best way to go is go to the, the cards that everybody knows about, the bicycles. So. The bicycle deck, everybody's seen these, even non-magicians have probably seen these at some points, like just, you know, laymen. Basically, anyways, these are just like classic bicycle cards. Like, there's so everybody's pretty much seen these before because and that's what makes them so good. Because they're not suspicious, right? So, anyways, I feel that these in my opinion, like, if I was to use the deck of cards, this is the one I would go to. In fact, a lot of other magicians use these as well, because I feel they feel the same way that I do. So anyways, it's up to you what decks you choose. I mean, in the middle is probably a good way to go. If you choose, you could go for the super detailed ones if your presentation fits it, but it will add a little bit of suspicion, just warning. So anyways, I feel that this is the best way to go. Well, that's pretty much it. If you like this content, subscribe down below to one of our future lessons. That's some more tutorials, do tips and tricks. I do these kind of videos, you know, just basically a whole bunch of magic stuff. That's pretty much it. Hope you enjoyed. Like, comment, subscribe. That's for now. I'll see you next time.